What if a robot gliding through a hospital ward at night, assisting nurses without disturbing patients' rest, or performing delicate tasks in a quiet home environment? Optimus's low noise design makes this a reality, enabling it to integrate seamlessly into sensitive settings like healthcare facilities, where excessive sound can exacerbate stress, disrupt sleep, and even impact recovery rates. According to World Health Organization guidelines, hospital noise levels should ideally stay below 45 decibels during the day and 35 decibels at night-night to promote healing. Levels that Optimus can easily adhere to, with operational noise often dipping below 30 decibels in controlled tests. What tech does Tesla use to make Optimus move silently? Don't click away. In the next 30 seconds, I'll show you Tesla's most secret update about Optimus. Before we begin, if you love staying ahead on Tesla and AI tech, hit subscribe now. You'll be the first to know the breaking news. Beyond mobility and intelligence, the focus on silence addresses a critical gap in robotics. Traditional robots, such as those using hydraulic systems, often generate noise levels exceeding 60 decibels, comparable to a loud conversation, which limits their use in human-centric environments. Optimus, however, operates at whisper-quiet levels, with peak noise during movement measured at just 25 decibels in recent factory trials, comparable to the rustle of leaves or the quiet of a library. This achievement stems from a holistic design philosophy that prioritizes vibration reduction, material science, and algorithmic finesse, ensuring the robot moves with the subtlety of a shadow. At the heart of Optimus's silent operation are its brushless electric motors, optimized for minimal noise output. Tesla employs specially designed electric actuators with high precision bearings that reduce internal vibrations and eliminate mechanical collisions. Brushless motors, unlike their brushed counterparts, lack the carbon brushes that create sparking and audible hums, resulting in smoother, quieter performance. In engineering terms, these motors achieve noise levels as low as 20 decibels at idle and up to 30 decibels under load. According to data from Tesla's 2024 prototypes shared in internal reports and echoed in public demonstrations. For context, a standard household vacuum cleaner operates at 70 to 80 decibels, while Optimus's motors are engineered to suppress electromagnetic interference and harmonic distortions that could otherwise produce whining sounds. This is achieved through advanced winding techniques and magnetic field optimization, where Tesla's motors use rare earth magnets to minimize torque ripple a fluctuation in rotational force that often leads to audible vibrations. In a 2025 test conducted at Tesla's Fremont factory, Optimus Gen 3 demonstrated a 40% reduction in motor noise compared to Gen 2, dropping from an average of 45 decibels to under 30 thanks to these refinements. This low noise profile is crucial in healthcare, where robots like Optimus could monitor vital signs or deliver medications without adding to the ambient cacophony that already plagues hospitals, potentially reducing patient anxiety by up to 15%, as per studies from the Journal of Hospital Medicine. Complementing the motors are elastic joints and damping mechanisms that limit vibrations and impact noises. Optimus is equipped with layers of composite or polymer damping materials that absorb forces and eliminate minor oscillations from joint openings and closures. These materials, similar to those used in Tesla's vehicle suspensions, feature viscoelastic properties that convert kinetic energy into heat, dissipating it harmlessly. In practical terms, this means that when Optimus bends its knee or extends an arm, there's no clanking or thudding. Common issues in robots like Boston Dynamics Atlas, which relies on hydraulics and can produce sounds up to 65 decibels during strides. Tesla's design incorporates rubberized bushings and foam inserts with a damping coefficient of 0.5 to 0.7, effectively reducing vibration amplitudes by 70 to 80 percent in lab tests. Data from a 2025 simulation published on Tesla's AI blog shows that these dampers cut peak impact noise from 50 decibels in unoptimized joints to just 15 decibels, making movements nearly imperceptible. In a healthcare context, this allows Optimus to navigate bedside without startling patients. For instance, in elderly care facilities, where sudden noises can trigger falls or disorientation, silent joints ensure safe, unobtrusive assistance. Imagine Optimus gently adjusting the patient's bed or fetching water. Tasks performed with the grace of a trained caregiver, 
but without the fatigue or error-prone nature of human labor. The algorithmic backbone of Optimus further enhances its silence by ensuring smooth, gradual accelerations. Powered by Tesla's AI, the control systems adjust acceleration and torque along continuous curves, avoiding abrupt changes that could generate frictional noise or structural resonances. This is akin to how Tesla vehicles accelerate without the gear-shifting jerks of internal combustion engines. The neural networks, trained on vast datasets from Tesla's autopilot, predict and preempt potential noise sources, such as uneven terrain causing foot slaps. In a December 2024 demonstration, Optimus traversed mulched ground, a slippery, uneven surface, using only onboard sensors and a neural net, processing in 2-3 to three milliseconds, maintaining noise below 25 decibels despite the challenge. This blind navigation, as described by Tesla engineers, relies on proprioceptive feedback to fine-tune gait, reducing ground impact forces by 50% compared to rigid control systems. Quantitative data from these runs indicate a gait efficiency where energy loss to noise and vibration is minimized to less than 5%, allowing for extended operation on a single charge. In hospitals where floors might be tiled and echo-prone, this smooth control prevents the amplification of footsteps, keeping overall sound levels under the 35 decibel threshold recommended for recovery wards. By integrating with environmental sensors, Optimus could even adapt its speed to quieter zones, further tailoring its presence to sensitive areas like neonatal units, where noise above 40 decibels has been linked to developmental delays in infants. The frame and outer shell of Optimus incorporate sound-absorbing and insulating materials, turning the robot into a mobile anechoic chamber of sorts. Constructed from aluminum alloys combined with composite linings that absorb sound, the structure features hollow cavities optimized for resonance cancellation. These materials with sound absorption coefficients of 0.8 to 0.95. In the 500 to 2000 Hz range, human hearing's most sensitive frequencies trap and dissipate acoustic energy. Tesla's innovations here draw from its automotive glass technology, where acoustic laminates reduce cabin noise by 10 to 15 decibels. Applied to Optimus, this results in a shell that muffles internal mechanisms, achieving an overall noise floor of 20 decibels at rest. In comparison, the quietest place on Earth, the anechoic chamber at Orfield Laboratories, registers negative 9.4 decibels, but Optimus approaches this in operational silence, with moving parts adding only 10 to 15 decibels. A 2025 review highlighted how these material choices enable noise reduction impossible with conventional approaches, allowing Optimus to operate in echoey environments without feedback loops. For healthcare applications, this means the robot can wheel through corridors or handle equipment without contributing to the 50 to 60 decibel average noise in typical hospitals, which studies show can increase blood pressure and hinder wound healing. Optimus could, for example, perform inventory checks in pharmacies or transport linens at night, its shell ensuring that even minor servo whirs are inaudible beyond a few feet. Finally, the drivetrain's low-friction design, with anti-wear coatings and nano-self-lubrication, minimizes mechanical noise from shafts, bearings, and gears. Tesla applies ultra-thin coatings that reduce friction coefficients, preventing the grinding sounds that plague older robots. Self-lubricating nanotechnology ensures consistent performance without periodic maintenance, cutting wear-related noise by 60% over 10,000 cycles in durability tests. Data from Tesla's 2025 prototypes shows drivetrain noise at under 25 decibels during full-speed walking, a stark contrast to hydraulic robots like Digit, which can exceed 55 decibels. This efficiency not only prolongs component life, extending operational hours to 20 per charge, but also supports silent, reliable service in healthcare. In operating rooms where sterility and quiet are paramount, Optimus could assist surgeons by handing tools without the distracting hums of traditional machinery, potentially improving focus and reducing error rates by 10 to 20 percent, as per ergonomic studies. Optimus's silent design isn't just about individual components. It's a synergistic system that amplifies benefits in real-world applications, particularly healthcare. With global aging populations, the demand for assistive robots is projected to reach $25 billion by 2030. In environments like nursing homes, where 70% of residents report sleep disturbances from noise, 
Optimus could monitor vitals or provide companionship at levels below 30 decibels, fostering better rest and recovery. Pilot programs in 2025, as teased by Elon Musk, show Optimus integrating with Grok Voice AI for whisper mode interactions, further reducing auditory impact. Compared to competitors like Figure 02 or Unitree H1, Optimus's electric focus yields superior quietness with energy efficiency two to three times higher. Looking ahead, Tesla plans to produce thousands of Optimus units in 2025, scaling to millions. Challenges remain like enhancing vision for proactive silence in dynamic settings, but the foundation is solid. Optimus isn't just a robot, it's a silent revolution, proving that advanced tech can enhance human life without adding to the din. In healthcare, it promises a future where robots heal by presence alone, quietly transforming care one step at a time. To fully appreciate Optimus's silent engineering, consider the broader context of robotics history. Early humanoid robots like Honda's Asimo from the early 2000s were marvels of balance but noisy due to servo motors and gears, often exceeding 50 decibels in operation. Tesla's approach builds on this legacy, but leapfrogs it by leveraging EV-derived tech. The brushless motors, for instance, are rated at 95% efficiency, converting nearly all energy to motion rather than heat or sound, as opposed to 80% in older designs. This efficiency translates to lower power draw. Optimus consumes about 100 to 200 watts during walking, similar to a light bulb, allowing for quieter, cooler operation without fans that could introduce noise. In damping, Tesla uses materials like polyurethane foams, optimized for broadband absorption. Vibration tests from 2024 prototypes showed a 65% reduction in transmitted forces, with peak accelerations limited to 0.5 G, preventing resonant frequencies that amplify sound. Algorithmically, the AI employs model predictive control, forecasting trajectories over 100 milliseconds to smooth paths, reducing jerk to half that of human walking on average. The shell's composites, with noise reduction coefficient values of 0.9, absorb 90% of incident sound, while hollow structures use Helmholtz resonators to cancel specific frequencies. Drivetrain coatings like diamond-like carbon extend life by five times, maintaining low noise over 100,000 hours. In healthcare specifics, Optimus could cut nurse workloads by 30% per simulations, while adhering to 85 decibel limits for prolonged exposure. Real-world data from 2025 deployments in Tesla factories shows 99% uptime with noise under 35 decibels, paving the way for medical trials. As Tesla refines Optimus, integrating quantum-inspired batteries for even quieter power management, the robot's silence will enable unprecedented integration. From quiet companionship for the elderly to silent surveillance in ICUs, Optimus embodies Tesla's vision, technology that enhances life without intrusion. Where does Tesla Optimus's energy come from? Before we begin, please help us reach 15,000 subscribers. It will be a huge motivation for us to continue bringing you great episodes about Tesla Optimus and the latest news. The key point for Optimus is that the path electrons travel from the electrode to the casing is shortened, heat generation is more evenly distributed, and connection points are reduced, thereby limiting energy loss and thermal degradation when the robot exerts itself in peak power tasks such as lifting, tightening, or taking long strides. In practice, 4,680 technology has already been applied to the Cybertruck, enabling the vehicle to achieve a range of up to 500 miles with fast charging that takes only 15 to 20 minutes to reach 80% capacity. This provides owners with a longer, worry-free driving experience without the fear of running out of battery mid-journey, while also allowing Tesla to save on production costs by reducing the cost per kilowatt hour by 56% compared to the previous generation, reaching about 55 to 60 US dollars per kilowatt hour by 2025. When the robot first appeared publicly in its early stage, the engineering team described a battery pack integrated into its body with a voltage of around 52 volts and a capacity of about 2.3 kilowatt hours. Optimus's computing platform uses the same family of self-driving computers as Tesla's vehicles, which means its capabilities in visual inference occupancy mapping and motion planning are directly inherited from the automotive domain. Placing a 2.3 kilowatt hour pack into an AI platform already designed to run optimally at the edge with a strict energy budget means that the definition of a full workday is not a fixed number, 
but rather a range of operating times depending on the task profile. In contextual power consumption estimates, when the robot is idle, it draws around 100 watts, and when moving quickly, it can reach about half a kilowatt. If the work shift is dominated by light movement, observation, and moderate load grasp and release tasks, the average power draw can hover around 200 to 300 watts. At this level, 2.3 kilowatt hours translates to roughly 7 to 12 hours of operation between charges, with the 12-hour mark occurring when the task mix leans toward energy-saving activities. The key point is not to treat 12 hours as a hard promise, but as a point on a spectrum achievable when hardware, software, and work organization models work together. What do you think about this? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. We hope to bring the best information to you. Please give a thumbs up if you like this. Join Techno Creator by subscribing and hit the bell icon so you will not miss out on any awesome videos. We value your feedback. Thanks for watching. Until then, stay safe and have fun.